Scott McGregor here with Rapid Media TV, and I'm in the Voyager Wilderness Program booth at the 2016 Canucopia Show with Maddie. Hi, Maddie, how are you? I'm good, how about you? I'm great. We were chatting earlier about how you offer like a bed and breakfast lodge based accommodation, but you also have so you're known for wilderness programs. Absolutely. Right. Yeah. What are the, some of the different questions you get? I mean, we're, lots of people wander up here and so very many. different people. Yeah. So what are some of the questions that people have when they wander up to your booth? Yeah, absolutely. We get so many different people coming up to the booth, different ages, different cultures, different backgrounds and different experiences, which is awesome to talk to. Um, I guess the main thing to talk about, though, is that we are really the one-stop shop. Uh, we can accommodate for everybody. So whether you want to do an extreme adventure into Quetico Park, you want to go super far, you want to do as so many portages. Who's asking for far and and, ex and everything? And, yeah, who's yeah. that? It's usually the younger groups, uh, such as the young adults. They're really adventurous. They want to get out there. They really want to test themselves, test their limits, see how far they can get into the park, do some extreme portages, you know, see the waterfalls, that kind of right. stuff. Uh, maybe shoot the rapids depending on their experience um, and then we also have you know the older folks or people coming with their families that right. just want to do more of a leisurely trip just get out there experience it take their time do some fishing along the way uh, maybe see some scenic things along the way like the pictographs check that out right. um, or some of them even just want to stay on the island at our bed and breakfast and they just want to do day trips uh, from the island and just check it out and ease into it and ease into you know gaining more of an appreciation for getting into the wilderness and, and backpacking it's kind of the same person maybe just at different stages of life right it's almost like a growing pattern you're absolutely right, right. yeah okay so you obviously have some packages for each of those things just maybe pick one that would fit nicely into the the more like go hard, go long category, and, yeah. then, and then how your other works in the other yeah, end of things. Yeah, absolutely. Um, we can really customize it to whatever people want, and depending on their levels and kind of what their idea of their trip wants to be. One of my personal favorites to talk about is the seven day, six night through Critical Park. Okay. That way you really get to see the best of everything. You can kind of taste a little bit of all the neat things to see in the park. Um, and that way you also can plan to have a layover day. So right. day five, you can stay at the same campsite as you were on day four. That way you can almost do day trips, check out other things into it. Um, and, th and that kind of gets you to see a little bit of everything in terms of the really big lakes, doing a little bit of creek work into the marshes, um, seeing some really nice portages, seeing the pictographs, seeing the cliffs, um, shallow lakes, deep lakes. It really gets you into there as well as seeing some rapids and falls. Great. And then how does the bed and breakfast work? Is it really just a, is it a per night thing? But it's, it's a bit of work to get over to you guys on the island. So yeah. if you're going to go, you might as well stay a while. Absolutely. Uh, so it, like we were talking about our location earlier, we're about an hour and a half away from International Falls. We're also two hours away from Thunder Bay. So whether people want to drive up, that's an option, or whether they want to fly into Thunder Bay, we also provide a shuttle from the airport to the island. We have a boat that will pick them up on the mainland, bring them over to the island, introduce them, show them around, give them a cup of coffee if they want it, right. and uh, just, yeah, hang out on the dock. Got the bed and breakfast there, uh, supper is included, as well as the breakfast in the morning. Sauna sits right on the lake. and Sounds pretty nice, man. Yeah, it's pretty good. Great. Yeah. Well, I'm going to wish you a great show. A great good. summer. Thanks Thank so you much for coming by. Thank you. Scott McGregor here in the Voyager Wilderness Program booth at Canucopia, and I hope you paddle forever.